Okay, Fangulem, um, a warm good evening, a warm welcome. We say Kaba, we say Kushe, we say hello. We say good evening, good afternoon, good morning, depending on where about the world you are. Um, once again, this is the Then and Now Media Empire. They bring to una another special program on this very special day. And me, where they speak to una today, me now on a host and presenter. And my name is none other but Prince Emil Koma. Um, today we get two special guests, uh, special in every sense of the word, and um, they're not strange to um, the inner of social media. One of them happened for be a senior brother, I call him a senior brother, despite the back and forth, happened for be none other than Mr. Kutubu Mohamed Koloma. And the other one is also a brother, you, you know, yeah, very key and strategic in terms of the conversation on a national level. We happen for be Mr. Um, Imran Ture. Um, Mr. Imran Ture, Mr. Kutubu Koroma, I warmly welcome Una on behalf of the viewing public to the program tonight, um, where we title The North South Divide. The North South Divide, the historical um, um, uh, perspective of Sierra Leone's history. We put them in two forms, cultural and political. And members say we talk about the north-south divide because there is a divide or there is there. So for help we for articulate this, rationalize this today, for let we understand them from a different perspective. Same story that we've been saying for over 60 years, we get two of the greatest minds in our country. And I say the greatest mind, and when I say I'm, I say I'm with adulation, I say I'm with pride, and I mean every word of it. And UNASEP will help for determine that by the time the interview gets to the middle, the center, and the end of this particular broadcast. So today, the 21st of May, 2021, welcome to the Den and Now Media Empire. Welcome, sirs. Good evening. Daniel to me, big brother, laying, laying candy for slain tell I do. How you man? So afar. I do ballet to you, sir. Ah, but no, no, so in the view. Then say senior na senior bra. One day big self na big and before I go talk, say man we don't wear that crown there before me. <laughs> so family, as soon as you see, it seems like it's gonna be a joy ride. They call them a joy ride. Because here is the thing which is important, and I like the onset and the outset and the opening of this program. It's not like we came in as enemies, we are all friends, and the common denominator here is Sierra Leone. Despite the difference in opinions, depending on who's how they look at the, the country from, because somebody go to look at from a southeast perspective, some people they look at from a northeast or north perspective. But the idea is now one entity, and it's called Sierra Leone. And when I see the opening, you know, between the two guests, then, which is great. So let me just go straight to business. And this is going to be between 45 minutes and an hour long program. I promise you now, it's not going to go beyond this. Um, Kutubu, I want to, I want to go to you first. Um, when we people and set out for chat the history of this country, we know say behind the back of colonialism and returnees and etc., they emerge a country called Sierra Leone. Give me a brief narrative if you can prior to independence about this country where it eventually emerged in 1961 to be called Sierra Leone. Okay. Well, as we know, where the slavery business on down. I mean, from the, within the 17th century day to come in the 18th century, you know, specifically 1808, Italian became a crown colony, then after a while, and they begin send people in Ghana, Trump for those settle. But the good thing will happen where they go, they, they meet Freetown, who say like really, really true the now too many people them that they get Freetown. Here is why I talk to the too many people they get Freetown. They got the chief. Where buy the where they buy the place from? That be it's in the man. So now they then he can people then go and go central. Okay, from there now you know begin divert they go upline here and there and all that. But that also some of the issue. The issue where me actually go and go directly to where we talk about independence today for us. What do you mean? Because me and you know, and I think we've not come on the program where you yourself talk about where me and you believe that wrong. What we come up? We see a lot of things said. Uh, up to the like, where they clean, we see them, we see them man and where they walk out with them carbolic, with them and then back, and they spray them gutter, and they so not be the gates in the mosquito yard, and they, and they. So, what you need for do for actually say, why a country where in a ten in day, where actually a place where they admire people in the candy? And if I'm not in this, I'm not in what they tell me, uh, in my tell me, say, 
Ni fo be call you the trouble university of Salio, not to na the first out in color. I mean, I was like taking a back with semi dani. Let me return in this year. And I, I hope so by God power, it will bring that inside the discussion also for the thing. But with all the job, the question of me, where I am in front of the who side did this connect come on? Why would they so now? Who saw they? So now, so me were open small and left any border there in, in Lukasa. Thank you, thank you very much, Mr. Kutubu. I'll go straight to Imran. So Imran, I mean, every every country has got some part. The forging of a country it derived from somewhere, whether from scratch or whether in existence. But there has always been contradiction in the formation of a country. Sometimes, for let a country them and the people they find a bearing, it becomes more like a difficult thing. However, despite we um, difficulties in arriving where we are, which we will go into, into to, to this program, yet somewhere along the line, colonialism, just like Brother Kutubu say, and where we are now, emerged a country called Sierra Leone. Give me a brief narrative from your own perspective. I know say there will be much difference, but always there is some technical little difference between X and Y. Let's hear that difference between X and Y, please. Hey, brother. I tell you, thank you way you make this platform today. Now, one way, really and truly, I don't de try for understand, and I de get so much confusion in trying for ascertain that understanding there. But um, just like we, my brother clearly say, then we colonize we, and we day insider colony day for one hundred and fifty years. One and a half century. We saw daily long that. Now we're not be the senior prefects for the other <laughs> colony them. Thank you know, you. we can can join later. That is Nigeria, Ghana, and all them places that they now we be get the headquarters because I did the governor general oh, yes. But um the whole thing itself, you know, for me, as my brother clearly say. Um, uh, be the team them gets that side of Sierra Leone. For me, I wonder we go away from there because that is part of the problem who gets in Sierra Leone. Sierra Leone, anthropologically, a very clannish. And that clannishness they gets serious, serious negativity where it creates for we. Where everybody, even what they tell the history of Sierra Leone, Everybody they try for tell them from Ion clan perspective, rather than we get a Sierra Leonean history, history for we all. We all contribute inside that history day and we tell them as it's supposed to be. So, what's in a Mion take? The colonial people them really misuse we. A lot of people not be tell we for say the with man and virtually come out as alone with disgrace because they may strike against them front and back. And Nadine Shekha Stevens developed a skill of oratory because Shekina be union man. Esa Kruman a union man. Sey Kamaratilo a union man. There are a lot of union people them. They, they strike against the, the colonial people them. Now the south, now the east, now the west. Cambia get the union with the help of a charismatic uh, uh, cleric, what they call either Contofili. Okay, uh, okay Imran, I, Imran, I'm going to pause you there respectfully. Yeah. Just hold on there because you, they, you, you're going somewhere where eventually we get for go. And yeah. I want to build the premise of this conversation here tonight, even though it's very short. So I'll take this to you, uh, Mr. Kudubu. Normally, um, what in transpire now um, the history before a nation can tend for shape a country. And the reason why they put this to you, eventually we don't see what in happen where they say, but like Imran be the go to. Um, but I still they put this to you anyway. So, in between the formation of this country, there is a huge narrative. Some of it is highly emotional because, like the word I gave me, they say, we're not the first country we've been this, we've been getting Motoka, uh, we've been we we introduced, we've been bringing train, especially in a region. But politically speaking, did these events manage for shape what we became or in between what happened, other people had hijacked the process and then we find ourselves where we are today? What say you, sir? Um, I can attribute that to one major factor, leadership without vision. I don't know, we know, I, I don't know if this program will be attended or some other program, I lay a case against 
lacking vision. I talk about Nigeria, I talk about Ghana. When the people in Mikam, people like Nkumade, people like Balewa, they, they say, you know, after I go, one day, one day, we come to, we go there, now it play at the world stage, we will do something. So they build institutions there. They build infrastructure, they hold on. But if you observe, we say really, really today, don't be honest with we say, we not be getting leaders and we go build on the little thing where the great people they left. They not build on them. They not, they not advance them at all, they not advance them. If you not believe, just do for the college. That same old um, structure or, or curriculum where they left it, say today, nine did it. So at least they connect now, who say today, it will firmly put out lack of, you know, um, uh, visionary leadership. And when I can and now then it brought into a lot of other things. Uh, Selfishness candy, Greek candy, tribalism candy, regionalism candy, this candy, the question, na me, na, that a free for all mentality, nobody not agree address issue. So, me, one hold up to that, say, now the lack of visionary leadership for be able for see tomorrow, waiting tomorrow will bring, now in bring we are, so me, one hold up, sir. Yeah, uh, I want to continue with you on that basis, De Kutubu. So, um, you are very much a man who is vast with historical concepts. Um, theoretically, practically, you are right in the center of it and you've demonstrated this attribute all over these years in terms of your podcast, vlogging, whether you're vlogging or blogging, it's been very, very eminent and prevalent in those conversations. But here is the thing, um, Kutubu, that I want to ask again, and I'm trying to draw this answer from you, sir. So, and I they ask this um, in terms of um, waiting, you don't say you vlog slash blog, um, blaming the present conditions the way the people then find themselves politically, socially, and um, economically um, speaking. You seem for be emotionally attached with the past. And waiting at the try for derive, if the past you are emotionally attached to it and uh, they suppose say you believe in that past day and somewhere along that past day not translate itself into the present and going into the future, hence the kind of problem that we, we have. So the question to you, sir, is um, um, did waiting transpire after independence, 1961, pre-independence, shortly pre-independence, and then after independence, the affect we present? Yes, again, Mr. Prince, it if, and in the final analysis, you will also come to this. You will, God will make you accept your conclusion. Okay, let me give you a few examples. Where you been to go to school, where you been to go to Albert Academy, you not been to go morning school or night school or even turn. Now, one shift you didn't get. Wait opening, seven o'clock, you didn't school, one, two o'clock, you didn't have net training. But now they will get night school. No, guys, why we get night school? Why people didn't get for good night school? Waiting the people they not be able to see for see if we can try for prevent, you know, any kind of a thing. So you know, ask me, argument to our stand on now, Mr. Prince is that we know because if you there, you know they see you, you, you feel a blind Bartimius, you know they see before. You know, we will do anything. Now make a bring Nigeria and Ghana, say the leaders are there. God be made them be, be, begin to see beyond independence. They begin to see. So they say, okay, then we turn on the now. Now this is a non do now, this is a non-do. But what you say to do. We said we were able to do the time for build dynamic economic structures and, and systems foundation today tomorrow. We said say, even when with man not good day, we said that this will drop, will drop, will drop, will push you. So in a familiar argument, uh, however, we will, now the lack of visionary leadership after the way people they not left, we will not have to build on a for make we place so, uh, so for me, you know, Salona is a very rich place in everything where they look at mineral wise. And a, and a human human wise and all that. But have we developed this? We have the the, the, the politics don't they before everything, everything are politics. We we, we know the politics, okay. But after our politics, I want to vote. Okay, we don't own election. And then Mr. Prince, after the election, okay, no, put and don't. Now you know what? Not beginning for governance. And governance, you get for also go beyond your immediate party. We go there, so me, you know, get once ideological and but if you get something for offer. To us, the country is social, economic, political, and cultural upliftment. I will bring you there. Some of we they see an idea. We see Republicans then, the Democratic Party, they see Democrats and then the Republican and then for the good of the country. Now that will not embrace it. And if you don't embrace her, now lip service. Oh, no, push her, no force, no push her. That's fine. It's good for you then told them. But how have you done it? Now how? Now lip service or now so now, now so many look at sir. 
Okay. Um, Mr. Turi, I bring this count to you, sir. Um, we four BRS them, they went to independence. Some asked for independence, say we want her now. Others said, let's wait. Um, those contradictions existed then. But however, the urge for independence was very, very demanding and was on the up. And we did attain independence. Do you think those contradictions then, we they, then for, we four BRS then carry forward at the time, get a kind of effect on we now 60 years on? Big time. Big, 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 big time. In fact, Nadiri really start the relay of backwardness. Because waiting happened, we won't forget an independence. So start with the people and we go go through the independence, they were not democratically elected. And when they go for go go duam, then carry the opposition go. When a PMP, where Chaka Stevens be happen for be the deputy leader. And um, waiting the notice when they go, the SLPP leadership, when I be the government, be too cozy with the white people there. Then we just they dance like Sally one size and they pull their rope. So then get the other opposition and we can feel to say, then why are too cozy? They must don't whisper something to them. They're not the work in the interest of the people there. Say, well, look, the best we will do, we're not going to be able to get this there. Because before they even go, the government, they already get a date. When I asked them, they care about the 7th of December, 1960, now one time. Now, even Ian, um, the, 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 yeah, the yes, yeah, McLeod, now he said to them, no, we're not going to worry. We're not going to get them. It's already certain, not to eat. He said, but we will get them another date because they be particular about the date and not to the effectiveness of the independence. While the Ghana model, when they come, when they get their, their, their issues, then they then go back to the people then. Go go ask the people and consent. Ask the people and what they want. So that they will not be getting an opportunity there. The people that will be there ahead, then use their discretion and go on with what they want. Because the opposition disagree with them. Immediately when they come back, one month later, they sack, they expel them. That includes Pasheki. So now they Sheki now from the, the United um, the, 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 the United National Front. Where he form them, one month later, now they he sort out, you know, um, the, the, the election before independence group evolve now into what they call APC today. You mean something like that? They all go as a group. They're not able to get agreement. So this issue where they happen right now, where we get a culture, because a government always get forget a government, then you get, get forget an opposition. Now that you call it government. The opposition that the government in waiting, that they give alternative, then get forget and debate there for me, then get um, the right temperature for what's the baby. But unfortunately, Sarah Leona from that independence day, they don't get the culture, say, the winner takes the winner takes it all. If I'm in charge, you don't ask me question. You for just follow what I do. That, that happened exactly. So now they, that culture they start. And my brother can always talk about that, Kutubu, can always talk about that, about precedence. When you see you don't start a negative precedence for break away from that circle day, and not can exactly easy. So waiting up now, then get that pet day, and that pet day not stop. That pet day not stop. When they come back, Albert Magai no agree for let Sam Milton govern. He do a leadership challenge. He beats Sam Milton. Then culturally, people they say, "Hey, no for me, can they bury them all? They all come then prevail pan and tell them for say, hey, no, 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 I big brother, I for left and get him. So he left and get him. They make a deal." The deal say, all right, I will give you ministerial position and I will give you party ministerial position. Then I shake it. That's it. You don't run after Sheki from a ministerial position. So when they make um, Sam Milton now, Sam Milton give Albert Magai position. He not give Sheki. So Albert Magai not be so happy with that. Now they break away. He and Sheki go from PMP. 
So this confusion, that particular aspect of history, people are not the talk about her. They can shy away from it, but it was a reality. It was not easy as people like can try to make say easy SLPP do well. SLPP. No, 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 no. There was civil war within the SLPP. Okay, the okay, okay, brothers. Bola Iman, I, I beg, um, um, just because for the purpose of time, you see, yes. the history of the country is so rich that we can yes. go on and on and on, but just for the purpose of time, uh, they kindly ask you for all your thoughts, right? They want to take this same thing to Mr. Koroma. Mr. Koroma. So um, from what you were just hear this brief historical narrative, it seems like the stage was set for the failure that we find, if we can call them a failure that we find ourselves in today, because what didn't define us then is what we've seen playing out today, 60 years on. Will you agree with that characterization, sir? Of course, but now they see it they like up to now. That's how they go, that's how they go to win a take all. Remember where I started early, I talked to the, I bring America, say America, wait to happy after, they don't do the election vote, they say they need okay, we are we can't help me now. Because remember, now for the good of the country, that make a talk say we all people they pay lip service to no put salon force, no put salon force, but it doesn't happen. No, even go to the MP then. They say country tanga. When they when they go to apartment, what they do, they raise all oh, man. I want this, I want this, I want it. But how about that? The ordinary man, yes, yes. You know, they say, so now so I look at some life. So we give me water talk and that. Well, we go up with candle, that the word answer. So it seems like there's a commonality here, and I, and I really like this because for once, and if we can practice this in a broader dimension for put we sort of um, political differences aside, stop practicing identity politics, and for once put the country in the middle, it seems like we can make a little bit of a gain because things that we don't damage who they agree to from the very beginning is um, um, difficult for them to patch them up, but it's doable. And um, Fambule, before I go to Mr. Imran Khan, I just want to remind you and I say, we did on the Den and Our platform today, the 21st of um, May, 2021, being our host and presenter, Prince Emil Koma, and we get two very special guests in person of Mr. Kutubu Mohamed Koroma and Mr. Imran Khan, people that we vast with the history, historical knowledge of the country, and, and we want to talk about this very historical knowledge today, but in a different perspective, it's not like most of whom we watch today, not familiar with the historical narrative of the country, yes we are, but the reason why we bring two brilliant minds into this mix is for help with for chat the course along the way so we can look at the corners, the cutting, the edge of witty you mean as opposed to how we supposed to understand how we arrive where we are today. Mr. Imran, um, this question goes to you, sir. This is quite important. In other words, same thing, waiting play out more than 60 years ago is as a consequence of a kind of a design that was meant to play out exactly like it's played, maybe not probably exactly, I might be exaggerating this, but there was a design because it, it's almost like scientific. We design the politics, we draw a dividing line between the North and South axis and play each other against themselves. If yeah. the maxim remain true, that divide and rule will work. So they did it to us and here we are today. Yeah, we we fought for it. How did it happen? Shekhar Stephen say and forget election before independence. They hold them, they lock them up. And um, can you imagine when they lock them up, the arrangements when they do them, finally they give Sierra Leone 7.5 million. After 150 years of colonization, 7.5 million I didn't give it. And the 7.5 million wouldn't give Sierra Leone. Then say, na technical aid. Then say, na loan. Then say, na... And like for treating and then give we give for. When you say they say Imran, do you mean like the colonial masters? Can you speak? Yes, the colonial, the colonial you masters you know, and then give it 7.5 million, you know? And what was the rush? What they get for waiting? Why they not ask them, say, all right, Una don't rule we for 150 years. Una they take things they want to export. Who have to see the books them? How na seven million number they give we? So then who was asking for the books? Sorry, sorry for the budge in because. 
This is a learning process for even myself when they ask the question. So I, I, I beg, I beg you, please, if I, you know, continue for budge in. So there were people at that stage prior to 60 years ago and just after 60 years before yeah. the independence, before 60 years. Uh -huh. It's like um, the need for take um, into account waiting transpire over that hundred plus or more years while we were yes. under colonial. Yes, but ask for records, you know, because you get intelligence people then, like George Stone. You get um, Mrs. Comis John, you get we Prime Minister when uh, um, Sir Milton, very clever man. He get a degree in history before he go, go pursue medicine. Can you imagine? He does arts, he does science. But the problem is, you can be academic and not intelligent. A lot of people don't know that, you know? So, 7.5 million, we don't even get parliament. Pass now, carry pass, smart, then go go back there, Israeli them. Now they can't can build parliament for we, then give we loan. Then they give you big discounts on that. You can know? we hear you say that again? How the parliament was built? Can you just repeat now that? Now, smart now they go out, approach the Jews, them, the Israeli them. Now, Israeli them build with parliament, and then give you yeah. a loan, and I then build them for we, and then do them for we with a big discount. When they split the money, then give we half, then the half now we pay for. So basically, they do them for we on discount, you know, big discount. So we the, the government asked Britain, Britain for make them help we or give we money for bill with parliament. They said they don't get money, money not they. So the people that were colonized for over a hundred or so more years. They don't get money, you they know. Don't get money. And I will take this, Imran. Imran, um, this, 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 this is emotionally distressing, my brother. And I know say they affect a lot of people. and people that will not be not learn about this before, including myself. You know, because I know the history that the Israelis built our parliament. How. I did not know this, I must confess. Well, I'll take this quickly to Kutubu, and again, for the benefit of time. Kutubu, do you think, would you say, because I've listened to you many a times where you chat this historical narrative, would you say from waiting with the year, or probably most likely waiting you know, that we were set up to fail so that the blame game can be traded among ourselves? Well, we, we don't go veer off too much for that because if, if, if I, yes, I've been a reader, so we let you say they actually be one of it. When they go back to 1962, they set up a commission at Salone and call them the Coal Commission. I don't know how many people are aware of that commission. That commission was supposed to look into the account of 1960. You're like the money talk, you know, nobody know account for anything of waiting upon, waiting and spend for that year, people say independent. In, so remember, we still get these white folks, they mean they weekly with civil service. You will get people like Commissioner Page them, you will get um, uh, Eric Fisher them, all of the, these guys that you are in. Even the, 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 the army commander said, I mean, with man. Yeah, Black Brigadier Blackie, Brigadier Black Blackie, Black Black the, the Commissioner of Police, that be with man, Mr. Killing. So you had all of these guys who have been in that place. So they were not very, very, very happy about how they were. And I mean, even with civil servants, them, they don't train them that much for them to take over. If you observe many times at a fault, we come to say, but we, 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 even we won't, we won't fall in service or we are diplomats or we'll send them, you know, go meet places like Ghana and Nigeria. I saw some of the they told them kind of what they did. Nigeria and Ghana, they make sure say they had all of that here. So like you ask the question, were we set for failure? Yeah, because we were in a rush for getting independence. When independence. We say, we You're don't right. match it for them. So it's they would hold a lot Mr. of Mr. Kutubu, Mr. Kutubu, do I must break this small because this is um, this is an educative lesson for me and a lot of the viewers, especially the young folks who are supposed to watch now or go watch later. So we were in a rush for independence. Did you just okay. say that, sir? Yes. So what you go construe the rush for independence? Why were we in a rush for independence? Were we being urged instead of we the people wanting independence? Are you implying that we were being urged to take this independence? Now the leader then be too angry no, for power. No, now, 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 now we've been rushed the thing. You only quite saying I make I come up with waiting. You know the the, the people they talk to civil servants and women they wait with them. See, remember we get the white people that will be there inside with civil service. They were very entrenched. They can tell you they were very entrenched. So then when they look at P, they will not be getting this kind of expert, experts then or the people that will really really get the type of training. But for example, most of the top civil servants, uh, people like Pamadi, the late Pamadi, the late MS, a number of them, he called them, they, they don't go to college. These people were clerks, they, they, they have been clerks, they're waving the walk. So when they white people then go, these are the people they now, way, 
you know, be able to understand how for write memorandum, how for do this, how for that. So that they think they now of late, 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 now even we get still with service skinny quality data. So the, the long and short of the day, we, we are not prepared for the team, but we Russia, but we not be prepared. Like way you will say Ghana and Nigeria. Now that make the only make comparative analysis. Sir. Then also you go see how history they repeat itself. What did they yeah. happen now? Where SLPP take power, where they forget that transition, where they for show them the books, they show them what they don't do, help the, inco the incoming government for get themselves strong in governance before they take over, then come the rush. Not only the first thing is so, now the same thing Albert Magai do. Because now Sierra Leone, the history of Sierra Leone, the people and with force embrace Western education and the Creole them. Oh yeah. Oh, now yeah. they begin at the positions them, they begin lawyer them, they begin doctors oh, yeah, them, everything, everything, they begin everything. education system and everything. Mm -hmm. Albert Magai and I go go bring affirmative action in favor of the Mende people. And quite a lot of them were not qualified for the job they did. Even if they get a degree, they don't get the experience. When they don't work with the Creole people, 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 when they don't work with the Creole people, that's what I think. I'm your opinion. I don't know what my brother thinks. You well, know? you're right, that because I, I just don't say this and I don't say yeah. you are not. Remember, when, when you talk, so I even bring the civil service in. Yeah. I, I bring the civil service in. We, we are not actually, because, but then, like you correctly say, not for saying that tribalism will be practiced now, but we said it today for the Creole. Yeah, we'll get, we'll get for do that. Yeah, because the Creole service actually, in terms of academic antecedents, in terms of administrative sagacity, in terms of everything, they were ahead now of late. They were way ahead. Late, late. We we border them from the boys and begin joining in the of late slate. So what I mean, what me border the talk so that the fact. So Mr. Koma, we go back to this city. We not be here. We be one independence, but we not be not prepare ourselves yet for today, tomorrow. When the people are where they go. Now me now now the thing is you see now so where things are what supposed for do what supposed for no for the, we're not able now. All oh, the little things where they so that. Oh, yeah, 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 here's the point I want for put to you both um, the two guests. Yes, I think there's a general agreement like we not be ready for independence. And there were people who spoke against independence at the time because we were not prepared or there should have been conditionalities, i.e. Siaka Stephen of all people. And I shall say Imran will agree with me because I'm the take the cue from Imran that Shaka Stephen was one of the people that protested against having independence then or the kind of independence where they be one giving. So if we were not prepared and we not be fed like other country then for self-determination as a nation and as a people, then that means the, the, the prospect of independence as a whole was given to us, was tabled to us, say, well, look at Munaki Havam, and the same people that colonize us they kind of give up, give us the condition in which we will go forward. Hence, why we hear something like what Imran say, the um, um, compensation where we receive was a meager as opposed to the term where they colonized we for, and there was no accounting. Kutubu, this is to you, and then from you, Imran Sef can attend for you know your talk about this. Well, believe me, we got to go around circle some of you. Like we correctly say, here is the premise of don't build. The premise of Nobel for this argument, we, we, we are not totally prepared in terms of the, 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 the manpower for handle most of the three and a half. Could you pause you, lap, pause you there again? Once again, forgive me. I understand we don't set the premise and we sort of look like, say, we go around circle. But no, um, there is something that's a determining factor where they try for establishing and they try for get them out of historically um, um, speaking people such as you and Brother Imran. So if we were not prepared, both in expertise, technicalities, and etc., and then we want to take an entire nation, why did we go for independence? Or were we the ones responsible for going for independence? That's my but, point, Kutuba. I just want this. I want to call self-aggrandizement. That's what I'm self-aggrandizement. Or you want to copy other people that don't see Ghana say, don't get you. March MS 6, 1957. We don't see Nigeria don't get itself you October 1, 1960. So uh, why then people are warned and neighbors say we all 90 way people they, they you know they, they administer we why they don't get we don't get sometimes I look at one for Lamakata, you know, say because we are selling all the copy. So there could be any of those factors, sir. That's what we look at any of those factors. Bogana don't you get why we don't forget. 
Nigeria don't get one of forget. It will be other continent. So that's so, what my opinion that's a, that might not be factual, but I'm that's so middle country. Yeah, you know, so in fact, when you look at when you look at the question I asked. There is um, um, no anecdotal evidence. There's conclusive evidence that we can study, scholars can study this. Then uh, also what I've been trying to provide is the circumstances. So we were not prepared. We're not getting the expertise for Cameroon. No, country. then I have to tell outside, no. Yeah, uh, no. yeah. So I bring this back to you, Imran. Mr. Kutubudo, I attend for answer that before we move on to the next um, step. What say you? Well, to start with, um, there was a dispute between um, 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 the upline people and the freedom people then. Because, because um, they're not be seen for their work in, 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 in synchrony. Then you find out for say, then we grade the colonial people then, grade down with, with royalties then. Because um, Sierra Leone na be, not to be a country, when they come, now the country them, different different kingdoms them, but um, you know it's man, because of the mentality, then they no feel comfortable for let we get king, make it not go look like for say equal to the queen or king of England, so the water down we own um, kingdom, to be in a chief that's so that's so end up in the chief rule, then we in the rule, yes. So then give with them chief waiting and day. But um, the thing is, with all that and the way happen, we don't even know we say. They're not, they will not be, we will be need for understand we say, anthropologically understand we all. Because if you will look at it, uh, 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 Brother Kutubu, look, Ayanga, Ayanga of Panguma, a whole paramount chief, can't join by Bure for Fetsi with Mande. There was no Mende and Timni between the two people. You know, by Shebora of um, 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 the Togolele side, can can join them. Now then three, three chiefs them do a, a, a coalition for Fetsi with man. So if you look at the whole thing, there was a situation where we for Bilonde a little bit um, longer, we try for consolidate, we try for build a nation as one, rather than a big clan in the nation. Because we still see that now, you know, where you get Tim Niman, they go only vote for the son. Why? Because not Tim Niparty. Then you get um, the Southern of them, then they only vote for the Pamsi. Now Pamsi, now, now you know, I mean, they party, I mean, they my party this. You know, so the clanism no go away. And we get Sierra Leone, now, now place where we get tribalism, we get clanism, we get a, uh, a, uh, 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 um, um, cronies, <laughs> you, know, get, you know, so until we deal with the issues and they, we are not going anywhere. Okay. And before we come by independence, now then turn and over, we don't address that thing and they, because these were kingdoms, little kingdoms. So now then turn and they, now we don't address that thing and they, yes. we can take them from there, even though I want to move to something else, you are absolutely right. But how many of we people in, at the time were equipped. And again, remember say politics, they play if we study the history, the North and South divide, which I want to continue with, was playing highly. And my next segment of this goes to that particular side of things in which there is this notion that um, um, the South is more educated than the North. In other words, that's, the question I want to to guess them, and they, 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 come, they come to that, in, um, Imran, the, the question I want to pose to the guests then is like, um, okay, this general notion that the, the South is more educated than the North beggars me for asking the question, when did we educated class or people in our country started getting being educated? Or was it just discriminatory that one particular person will prevail in terms of colonialism and prior to colonialism or pre uh, uh, post colonialism, neo colonialism, now it cannot define all of them kind of things in the Imran. I'll take this to you. Well, my brother, to start with. Who are the first people in our country, Sierra Leone, we kind of um, um, get education. And they talk about the divide now between people. Let me call it culture, the cultural divide, North and South. The South are tremendously known for being highly educated people. In. And up yes, to this day, 
education yeah, yeah, yeah. is attributed to them. Is yeah, that yeah, the yeah, case, yeah, or is there yeah, something Western, else Western that we education. don't know? Western education are enforced embrace them from the white man in the Creole. But before they even opened FBC, 1700, there was University of Arabic Studies in the North by uh, uh, um, a, a very renowned academic called Fode Tarawali. There was, there was always a university in Agbilenix in Akambia district. Okay. And at the first university, that's not Sierra Leone. Okay, that's that's kind of interesting. Now they can't write back so to you, you, find you out, that you because find I want for like, no no hold, hold hold your thoughts right there. And the brain can write back to you for letting like you elaborate. Kutubu, is this something that you're familiar with, sir? Well, to be honest with you, you know, now when we are today, these are two, three days, and I bring that up. Now it bring up. up. But I don't know why that not be on the radar all this time. Now me say good, you know, good one, Kutubu, good one. And the reason why I pause the brother for come back to you because. You are a learned man and you're familiar with the history. So for let this slip your mind, um, I won't get to the bottom of it. So I go back to Brother Imran. Will you elaborate, please? Will you elucidate, please? Open us up. Well, during the 1700s, people in the Komot in Mali, the Komot Guinea, they can university in Australia, and be let it say, for Ganga land Arabic. But you see, what, um, 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 the British they always get this notion say anything British is better than anything else. So even when they do with statistics about literacy, when they questionnaire, they not put say, can you read or write English? Or do you read or write any other language? It was only done in the capacity say, can you read English? If Again, you so, say that those questionnaires did exist then? Yeah, when they do when they, 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 they do the literacy, they when they do the literacy in Australia, they know they ask you if you write Arabic or read Arabic. They don't they ask, say, can you read or write English? If it's no, then you are illiterate. But then people then they, I remember even when I be the go school and then places then they, they tell her then they write measurement for Arabic. People then they write Arabic, then they write letter to each other in Timni, but in Arabic. Now that area then they so they were literate, they were educated. They were very, very astute Arabic scholars. Even the history of Sierra Leone, when you read them, you go and read the Englishman and say, and write what Aydara Fontopili say. He was a charismatic cleric, very intelligent. So the area of um, the North, even that part day of the North, because the Bombali side and chieftaincy gets very superior um, administrative um, strata. Then yeah. when you come to we own side, now the that the Cambia side, you find out for say we own chief tenancy that the Adikali system we get an undertone of Islam. Now I mean, they call it the, the Adikali system. So so what they try for say Naya is people really read and write, and people were highly intelligent because if you read the documents. Where I don't know if um, Kutubu will agree with me, they were to the colonial people and self self rights and say, by Bure, fed very intelligent war. He was a very skillful fighter. Okay, I want to I want to pause on the by Bure issue, okay, because it's kind of intertwined. This is I, 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 because it's all, it's all intertwined because because during the time when the all tax war be they go, it be they go simultaneously with the Mede uprising, but they all not be the all tax war. So all, yeah, I, all I, will, I will tend for one for flow along with you on that because when you organize such things, these things are strategic. That means there is a kind of commonality, whether or not yes. code that they use, and that speaks a lot. But I want for yes. you hold your thoughts. I want for let you hold your thoughts um, equal time, uh, but I, 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 you seem for getting very excited because probably this is a subject matter that you understand well. But equal time. Let me go to Mr. Kutubu. So, Mr. Kutubu, you only learn about um, um, Western um, education, which we championed for many, many years and became to be known as the anthems of um, West, um, West Africa. Mm -hmm. But historically speaking, um, Sir Kutubu, who do you think they come first? Was it um, um, the Arabs? We can eventually teach you Arabic, like what Iman they say, or was it the English? The bottom well, line is it's just like we culture was influenced by outsiders? Well, obviously enough, 
I know say bro, England go agree with me say that the Western English people they are their culture and influence me. For example, we talk about oh, Mr. Magana is the first M.A. countryman we become medical doctor. Oh, M.A. Albert Magana is the first M.A. countryman we become a lawyer. You know, and sure. all, you know, anything in the. So in other words, the white man, the, the Western white man, which they they try for maximize their interest by proportion, by selling their own culture, by selling themselves, by making sure they you know say when they are the best and the brightest and they get everything. So like the thing where we bother you bring your cup on. To be honest with you, nobody will claim monopoly over knowledge. I have never known of this. That's what he bring them up. Now what they told them this year, and he bring them up. Because we've all been glued to this 1827 University of Saloon camp, 1829 and the Walsh Memorial School camp, Nine Gamma School camp, 18, 1806 or whatever, Nine Bow School camp. So these are all the top of things that we hear. When they make every school behind that, so now go train all the chiefs and pick them, then go do this. So now make you get everybody from all sides of the country and they go to post school. These are the things that will be the law and the audience and underlying, I didn't call them, say they people find them in only day. But the thing where nobody will be there for promote them, they don't call should not be there. So now waiting, we see now they elect us. Uh. So now you take down. Oh, oh, right. They're not be ones, they're not be ones the missionary themselves on that side of um Sarah Leon. Then drive them out. And now one of the reasons that we make the British defense against Idara, because Idara not be the allowed them for can infiltrate. Because the people were highly intelligent, highly educated, and they're not be they allowed for me to bring Christianity to Canada end day. And if you notice now the North, the first side we embrace Western education at Tonkoleli, we're very close to the Southern province. We, we, we get border with them. That is the um, um, SDA and all that kind of thing. But the reality, the reality here is, then sending the, and then side and they, they're not be the same in Peking and go Western school. Anybody want to learn learn Arabic and become an Arabic scholar. They mean they write and talk Arabic fluently. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but, but but here is the thing. Here is the thing, um, um, Mr. 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 Tui, and um, to um, um, we guest as well, um, um, the other guest, Mr. Kutubu Koroma, and the rest of the viewing public. And um, I need clarification on, on on this because there are anecdotal evidence, and if, if there's conclusive evidence elsewhere, if you can make this known, I go happy for go looking to around. But I've seen some of this, so. One renowned scholar, Dr. Wilmot Blinden, you know, acknowledged that there was a kind of form of university. I don't know, been tea or Winley, how they call them. We, we I mean, let, let me say studies, and we can't dismiss that. Will you elaborate, please, Imran? Well, um, the university be founded in 1780 to 1880. Now, a social scholar, what do they call him? Um, Fodi Tarawali. And um, his ancestry, we come up from Guinea. Because you know, for say, quite a lot of the waiting um, um, Timni people and come up from the Futa Jalon area. And all the area yeah. they were was Islamic. So they virtually come with Islam with them. And that was very, very, because you, you remember, you know, Man, uh, Mansa Musa and all them people yeah. in there. Yeah. Quite yeah. a lot of Sierra Leonean and get influence from there. And even the Madingos, them and all them people, then they, you know, these were families of clerics because then there's the day you have to don the Quran, you finish the Quran and become a Sheikh. That was a mouse. Now that's like, even though they're not under the late for camp uh, Western education, when they join Western education, you cannot beat them. They get a photographic. So, so, um, 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 Imran, Imran, um, Assumably, there was this university, you know, led by this um, um, Tarawali, this Muslim scholar. But subsequently, that university was kind of destroyed. I mean, it, yes. there was a, some implosion within yes, with destroyed university. Jealousy can happen where the team need them can feel jealous because of the popularity of the university. So the team needs them get some kind of issue with the so them. So they fetch a war. Then born the university. When they born the university, the man his whole life as a missionary, he not stop. Now they he start an open university where immediate care knowledge go to people in their houses. So the first open university, possibly in the world, now let it say start. Because he not build 
get money for Bill again, and the colonial people are not interested in Arabi. How well so documented that is, or who side people like can go and fend this history? This is quite important. That's when we come across them, when I come across them, even uh, the brother Kutubu, I send a copy of um, me source and finding to Ram, make himself look at him. Because where you see that kind of thing, you know they keep on to yourself. Because okay, we we need we we need for no thing there for that we get that national pride, so that we all go respect yourself. We know yourself as a people. Oh yeah, you know. Okay, okay, Imran. Im 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 I can talk Kutubu quickly, um, Mr. Mr. Kutubu. Um, yes, there is quite a revelation being made here um, tonight, but we get to <laughs> trust the brother and not say history has been distorted throughout man's um, um, occupation of this uh, place what we call the universe, both for selfish reasons and for good reasons. The British came, they ruled us, they colonized us, they left us with some good attributes, but at the end, the relationship was an exploitative one. So oh yeah, oh. Me, so few are people, so many are people. It has to be on a divide and rule. So they sell Kutubu something else, as opposed to the same thing with them will sell to Imran, just for set you at loggerheads. But however, you seem emotionally attached with British colonialism. Are you, sir? No, mm, hey, but low, low, low even your suppose this argument that you know certain <laughs> even in Nigeria, who got a cough the, the, the north, who said the yeah. house and the full and they look up, look at the one. They made the play be then which it up instead and then become the dominant <laughs> yeah. yeah so essentially <laughs> the same thing the American would say earlier they come for maximize their interest by proportion they look people to, they, they, they go to people the way they know so they will get over you know, give them all the tia now make I say if the major secondary school where they can go who said they can go now they can go both school 1906 or something like that. And they say, okay, now like, we shift that they call it a picking and go there. Why you go to P1 school and how about the other places? And but then they go make a major. That I mean, you see a lot of northerners went to. Now, now, now because, now because yeah. they, they get a lot of resistance from the north. They, for the north wants them. Then we rebel. You know, saying so that the northern they rebel against them with the help of the Creole. Because when the Creole and Canadian self get interest. Can you imagine what they go for go arrest by Bure? They meet newspaper then I was not to come on newspaper then. My Bure cannot read English. Would I be the reader for him? Now then she can then create my chance, there will be the gop line. And then they give them all the information. <laughs> they become intelligent. Kutubu, Kutubu, this is this is quite interesting. Well, I'm, I'm not going to shy away from what the brother they say. So I get a part two. <laughs> you know, it's so interesting. Okay, Fabule. Okay, let's let's hold it. Let's hold it right there. Let's hold it right there, brother Imran and brother Kutubu. Fabule, I mean, this this now interesting conversation the ongoing at the platform this evening, the twenty first of May. It's a Friday evening, right here at the United Kingdom, where they broadcast from. And um, it's also in the evening back home in Freetown, Sierra Leone, and different time scale in different parts of the world. But very interesting <laughs> conversation. It is serious, but there's a lot of humor into it because that was then as opposed to the now. But for a people to understand where they are heading, they need to understand where they came from, where we are, how we got to where we are. And that's the only way we can forge a way forward by understanding how we arrive where we are. And this is what the discussion is all about here tonight. But here is the thing I want to bring a few announcements to Fambulem. We got a new program on the Den and Our platform where we call the Week in Review. The Week in Review obviously just means the Week in Review. So we go bring brilliant minds, analysts for can capture, conceptualize the issues basically look at waiting happened during the course of the week. We made the newspapers, electronic press, and whichever way you want to call a weather and a radio, we'll bring these minds for discuss these things because in so doing, we're able to bring information to we people, we go empower their minds for make them independent thinkers. This is what we are doing here building up minds, changing the narrative, empowering people so that they can become the independent people as we expect them so that choices that they make will be independent. The Then and Now platform equally they mean for expand. There's a new program coming up as well, which translate means my voice, your voice is equal to our voice. Our people has to be informed about the choices they're willing to make. And soon, will come elections. When elections come, 
We don't tell people how for vote. We only they provide the information where relevant as to the decision where they therefore make. Mm -hmm. So when they make the decision, it's all theirs. The then and now platform, we call on the media empire because we aspire for grow up to higher heights. So in this regard, yes, we have achieved, but there's so much more to be done. And it is going to be done because all of what we um, set out as our objectives are doable, okay? In this regard, we can promise when I say, a radio station will soon be ours. We're gonna be radio soon, and we're gonna be heard all over the world. We're gonna increase not only our capacity for do television, but the value of the contents that we produce, the mechanisms that we use, the materials that we use, the equipments that we use, is soon going to be step up. I can promise one of this. Yeah, we are in the making. Then and now it's no longer about, about the, the journey. It is about the destination. But back here again to reality. Reality is what I speak because as a pragmatist, we get two special guests here tonight in person of Mr. Imran Ture and Mr. Mohamed Kutubu um, Koroma. Um, Imran, I want to bring you down to famous names by Shebora. If a name of that nature was mentioned just in passing, what would you attribute to that name? Historically speaking, because well, now be a very strong ally to Baibure and um, um, Ayama of um, Banguma. Now they help him perfect the hot tax war. And if you go now put local districts, they get uh, Roman the outside the Mende warrior they be day. Where they be first with Baibure against the witchman them. And as I say, they create now they be the intelligence to Baibure. Now I make Baibure in your war be very organized and. Very, very program. They're not be the go go fetch them as a number. Now, gorilla tactics. They know who side the white man they pass, then they ambush them, you know. But you see, white man, they, the things they wouldn't do, it is premeditated, it's not accident. Then do the same thing to the Creole, then the Englishman they are. Do you realize? Say, okay, the okay, say, Iman, 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 hang on, Iman, Iman, hold on right there. Land, um, land. <laughs> Do you realize that the Creole self self them together in civil war? The Maroon versus the Nova Scotia. So are they, are they, are they, are they, are they come to that? Are they come to that? Let's avoid the digression in the meantime. Because now the same thing number now at Ibuto before they go to um, 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 Bora Kutubu. I want for keep in line with the same Chief um, Shebora because when they talk about the amalgamation of a chiefdom, and several yes. being able to play a greater part in there. And that connection did not be one for letting you. Yeah, play. yes. Uh, well, several several and be allied with Baibure, they fetch the war tooth and nail. But I mean, eventually the British they get uh, more firepower where they not be get, so they lost. When they lost, can you imagine they exile you from your own country to Ghana? All three of them. Then they slaughter all them officers there. They were well, what was the resistance hand. about? Because this was a, like an earlier resistance, you know, a sort of axis. Yes. What was it? Uh -huh. What was it about? Now, because of the whole tax war, the people that say they're not going to pay taxes to them because they are not indigenous. They are the indigenous people. Okay. Now they're for they in charge. People don't use for pay to them. Now they're for pay to. Which man say no? We are in charge now. So they're not be like that. And the Creole them, one of the reasons when they can ask you, they want a state for themselves. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. yeah. the with man and the field to say that the blessing for them, then how they be full when well, they overseas, that's so when they go still full. No, they were wise, they were clever, they come with a lot of brilliant minds there. Look like um, Wallace Johnson. Now, one of the key members that for Pan Africanism, Eliza. True. You know? So now they be the pop because we not even get politics, it's the creole that we get the Congress Party. They get Sierra Leone Independence Party when uh, oh, yeah. this guy, Lamina Sanko. Yeah, yeah, they all be in it. You know, so we the country people that will not be even a political party. The Creole, they don't get political party. And politics are the Western area, the only functionable. Correct? Yeah, now they will be in a protected assembly. Now yes. they, they, they are that colony. They, they, for them, you are apartheid, actually, apartheid. They almost get apartheid with us. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yes, okay. they did. That's oh, okay, we, they did. We, we gradually they run out of time. This is this is this is very, <laughs> very is interesting. Brother, I hope so we can organize this again, but I can't talk to Kutubu quickly. Um, 
Kutubu, you are a man of the letter. Um, um, when we talk about um, historical perspective now a country, and you know, person, I believe we get respect for the British. Oh, and yes. you know, whether you get respect for them or not, the fact belies say that once upon a time they were our colonial masters. Of course. And I believe, say, the question I will ask you, Mr. Kutubu, is there are things where you really appreciate them, you, you, you know, yeah, for. And um, during the time when they govern we, I don't know whether I think that we can be proud of because that means they set we up, in your opinion, against other African countries, other African brothers, which is we proud for say that during the rule, we were the center of British colonialism in terms of um, the headquarters for ruling other African countries. Mm -hmm. We proud for say now we mm -hmm. West African country, and they first introduced motor car, and they first introduced hospital, and they Train. first at the expense of other African countries. Can you speak to this please, Mr. Um, Koloma? Thank you. You remember we all oh, start this program. The earlier postulation was that we not build and not build on infrastructure when they left. For example, we talk of the armed forces. We've been getting the, one of the best armed forces to the extent, if you remember World War II, so I don't even beat Japan, not the, you know, that bomber. Now make we they celebrate Mayon, that's I don't, every January they celebrate Mayon. Now, because of that significant victory where Salute Kotiye me put over in, in Japan, now Battle of My Own. Okay, they left even police, we police them. Me and you know, then 10 a day, when you see a policeman, in very appearance, the uniform way where you see the awe of respectability and dignity. In other words, now people that will believe in law and order and structure. Everything was kind of, when you pass common entrance, like for them school and go, oh, now go, Albert Academy, has any. Remember the beginning, white guy, for example, Gamma School be get one guy who they call Frank Wood, a witchman. We be get one witchman who they call Mr. Rogers. So go now, please, of course, Mr. Rogers, we meet it. You get, um, uh, you go now, you know, then school, then so, so, you go now, St. Edwards, you meet Father Mokai, you, yeah, Father Mokai, you go see case, you meet Father Lamb. You go even both school, would I meet it, um, uh, Mr. W. Smith and um, uh, Holding and all that. And they, those guys, they carry the, the British structures and date at that place in such a way that you they actually see, like I said, Mr. Prince, you actually saw the rest. Now, what you they roll back? You get people the way they can, they say, then I see who servant, and you know, even up to, they can't even write the memo, nothing of it. So, in other words, I they go back to my original argument, the good, the, for, although I know say, now 100% infrastructure, they may be, but the little thing where they may build for we, we not we 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 not continue. We not improve on them. I make I be talk about leadership not being there. Visionary leadership and anything. So there are a lot of good things same way. Actually, they can go. I go to I see which man joined in as I know like Justice Atodobs. I saw him sitting. Over you go even you call one when they call Kandapa. When I do to even you remember the name that I was very familiar to him because of the discipline, because of this, because of that. So. Yes, okay, I think about there are some good things where they let the trouble will get we not develop that today. We don't name it today. But the, the good things that we get yeah. look at if you flip them, okay, the good run. things that they left now for in the advantage. Like okay. for instance, the curriculum wouldn't be get them to teach people and for let them be subservient. They're not be the they're not be the train and for me they think for themselves. And at that problem, they will still get Sierra Leone. What you see, motor man get PhD. So, 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 so hang on, hang on, hang on, right there, Imran. Um, Kutubu, what do you say to that? Because it's the same thing that I was going to take to you. Yes, we can get the emotion, especially we were born during the era and day, and see them good things in day. But some of the good things appear to have been for just a few and not the many. And I think Senai Imran they speak to. So it was deliberate exactly. or mislead, mm -hmm. divide, and rule which benefited only a few who are emotionally attached to that era because they benefited from it. What about the masses of our people, Mr. Koloman? Well, okay, let's ask the question. Why today we lawyers and the Georgia and they wear gown and wig and then sleep? <laughs> let's ask well, fundamental question. If it's a question, if it's a question, maybe it's rhetorical, but if it were a question, that demanded okay. answer, I can provide a quick answer to it. Oh, fine, it's I the will same be thing that could do with social engineering. There was an agenda. The relationship was an exploitative one. Yes. Okay. Was it, sir? <laughs> mm -hmm. Because so we're going to play 
uh, I can boast of train. I ride, I rode train so many times. And every time when I hold a program, when I get a little bit carried away, I mention trains because as a boy, I rode train. I live now. I rode train go to Model Kuna, that is more than that state. So I just they walk down, you know, yeah, 10 meters, 50 meters, and jump inside train. And I rode train a lot. But when I don't grow up, when I look at the evidence, it was just the massive exploitation of the country for transport goods. Where yeah. something we carry banana yeah. and plantain inside, but waiting and get it, you don't even see it. And it was all that the interest that they seek first. Yeah, but then why did we we just get, get, why not get a vision for say okay, daddy? But why we not do anything yet? We're not going to just complain, complain, complain. We yes. have to move over I to the point. I get your point. Me, they say now because then we make we for that we subservient for serve them, but okay. rather than we able for solve problems then we said they're not be teach we for do that okay so we're more dependent on them that anything where we need for do we get for you know we will not be getting initiative and take it they will not get now that make now that make them even we can can university now i say i don't i'm not calling the lecturer the doctor so i don't mind if you get phd you're gonna go be for a doctor oh yeah you're gonna try about a doctor you know what you're for and right. it's not meant to be like that. I know one day you read and they call us in England, yeah. When are they? Okay, start, okay. Uh, when uh, they um, call them lawyer. We we lawyer. we run we run out of we run out of out of time, and I want pushing some <laughs> quick things. Um, if I can quickly, obviously okay. the historical chemistry here is in 1808 we became a crown colony, of course, and under that crown colony, we we the boast or quick for talk. Rightfully so, the first people then forget college, you know, here in West Africa, which I believe is the first thing where they teach. Not your college, now, but those. Yes, <laughs> but we need to understand what they first teach there and why they teach the first thing where they teach there, which was theology, which it be based on. We really need to understand that. And Una, the scholar, they need to articulate that. We equally need to talk about electricity. Yes, we had electricity, which was a good thing. But where was the electricity? Who was it benefiting? Was it just up at the calling place yonder? Because I know, say, we train mini come, the last stop na a court. And if you mm -hmm. go beyond Dove Court, then I up the hill, hill station, okay, hill station, who saw all their expatriates there and who were the expatriates? White people and White people. few of we Creole um, brother them at the time. But another labeling, because I was 60 years ago, I just they say we need to understand these things if we need for forge ahead. But here we are 60 years on, we are still struggling. So exactly. what the program are they ask again? Mm -hmm. We have arrived where we are because we do understand where we came from. That's why we organized this program yeah. tonight. So the question, final question to Una uh, uh, Fambulem, uh, Kutubu and Mr. Um, and Imran, how do we go forward from here? Because we will see the contradictions and the differences and the politicization of so many things, identity politics, regional politics, the great divide, how we term this um, program here tonight. How do we go forward from here? Who do I want to go first? Well, we, get go back. Back. So, we, we get for go, go back. <laughs> we get for go back to the drawing board. You know, once in the way I will recommend and I will say, may his soul rest in peace just because of that peace day. My brother will agree with me. Sam Milton worked with the Paramount Chief then. Mm -hmm. He walked so closely with them and he be so proud of the cultural uh, 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 um, system that he incorporates them into the general governance. Mm -hmm. And I feel that we will continue, we will be make the chiefs them get, like how we get House of Lords now, yeah? mm -hmm. where things that wouldn't do in parliament, if will be the second house for me to get checks and balances. Because Look like Pakabago go bring American system. Where the the the, 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 the president they appoint people them. We're not to that system there with Malef Kiwi. We get parliamentary system where everybody get to be elected. Yeah, now but, we get but, a but not with all due respect, Mr. Mr. Chuel, so Pakaba responsible for that because over the 60 year period, long before no, Mr. Ka, come, Ka, come, Ka, come. What do you mean they talk about this uh, parliamentary system Pakaba meet? Now Pakaba na income make this arrangement here way. All the cabinet ministers then are the presidents, they choose them. They are not elected. They are not, it's not democratic because they are not answerable to the electorate. They are answerable to the head of state. 
And it's a, it's a it's a good point that you make, Mister Ture. You but know? then you see, and, and, this and, and, creates and, 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 the yeah. platform for let we go back where people yeah. like they ask, but would be do this? Why this you be know? happen? Why they okay. make this? Why one party rule? Why we bring a brigadier or a soldier inside the house? Why we bring police bambe camera inside the house? You you you, nah, you know. Nah, so nah, the nah, question nah, again nah, to Mr. Nah. Imran and Mr. Ekoroma, where you finally take the the the, the pulpit, is what's the way forward? Because these are things that we know now. A good way to highlight that. Me, or if you just give me, if you just give me, just bring only did what he saw fit at the time. What's the way you forward know, from yes, here? Yes, we do um, But the problem is from people away land book, not smart, because America system where you go go bring up, America get two houses. We get one house. It's not compatible. America get good system for checks and balances. Britain gets the House of Lords, it gets House of Commons. Anything where they vote for at the House of Commons, then they can't go to the House of Lords. Men they go go look up. If it's not right for the country, then they send and come back. The Paramount Chief then could have played that role. And we get all them things there day, day before we get to independence. We for we don't build upon them. But the thing is. We get this inferiority complex when I'm one of the... So Imran, 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 Mr. Turi, the if we have time, I will allow you to elaborate, sir. Yeah. We can go on and on with that. If we had time, we would have done this, we would have done that. We've had a conversation. And the question here, you know, yeah, your final submission is, what is the way forward knowing all what we know now? Remember, say, we get the benefit of hindsight. And this is what I want for you to deal with. What's the way forward? The way forward, we all get for come together. We will not be done do this all. Make all man put their skills, their abilities, because we get different orientations and all their orientations and get something for offer. Make we try for build something unique, something Sierra Leone. Make we try for go away from this mentality where everything foreign is better than what is indigenous. Even with education system, it's about time we change the syllabus because my brother talked about that earlier. The same syllabus. I cannot believe up to this day with a, one of the biggest markets, now Diamond. Thirty day, University of Sierra Leone offer Diamond cutting. That should have been top now the na, 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 with education system because that's what they did in Botswana. Then they add value for the Diamond because then they cut them in Botswana. We cannot cut Diamond. How about we university offer a course where they teach people and for cut diamonds. So basically, we therefore come back to the drawing board, respect we culture, believe in we self, teach we begin in civics, for men and proud, tell them all the things they already know about say, look, we society not be that backward. We had university before the Whitman camp. We had our own languages before they came. We had expertise before they came. We had our own religion before they came. By that, people will begin to believe, say, we not of that dumb people then. Before they go around, they talk for say, like, what you want to say, they talk. Iman, Iman, you make a good point, but let's la, la, la bash into that one more time and one last time. Yeah. And I know they want to lose my thoughts on something where you really say, and I make a decide for jump in again before I go to yeah. you, which is um, we need for teach civic. A civic education, which is something where you do, which I do, which Mr. Kutubu do. And I am deeply into civic education. But looking at the time, the reason why I say again, we get the benefit of hindsight. Whilst it is a good thing for them, we dwell back into civic education. From a pragmatist point of view, from a realistic point of view, Mr. Ture, mm -hmm. how possible this is? Is it doable? And how much time is it going to take us, you know, for go back into that and begin to teach a population we don't become dislodged, we don't become reoriented in something altogether different or what will be the priorities? Is that about the civic education now or is there something else before the civic education? I hope I make sense to... Yeah, I, I get your point. Well, where there is a will, there is always a way. If we are hungry to do that, we can do it. Because like, for instance, Quite a lot of things the way I know about Sierra Leone. I was not taught at school. Now, out of interest, I go out myself. They do research. They read. They talk with people. Them, they get their information there. And I make anything where I get some hand, where I know say useful. 
and he passed them to other scholars. The like question I do then is there. I sent quite a lot of the archive to uh, Mr. Kutubu for making himself aware of anything there because he's a good teacher. Make himself good, put that in a curriculum for educating people and say, then thing there don't happen then day. And we get for embroiden with horizon in a sense. Because you see me, brother, you can get anything for it. Brilliant, if fine. But if you don't get a root, you don't know your own identity, you don't understand your own identity. Me, brother, you go find them very difficult for let you try. Look at me now. Imran Toure is not ashamed to clean wet man toilet. But if I go to Sierra Leone and tell me like, oh, me to grow old, I'll try to go clean toilets for. <laughs> At the end of the day, okay. now they, okay. now, now, now the colonial mentality, where they inside we, you know, what, you, what you've done. The Salomon go beg you money. Then, for instance, some man is sent, <laughs> is sent to me say, hey, okay, Imran, we, 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 we're running out of time. And this yeah. is Kutubu it's, equal time. You've been speaking for quite a while. Um, let's just jump straight to um, Kutubu. But I like the way you've just made my evening, despite the tense atmosphere with which you just say last. Kutubu, um, sometimes we dwell into history and we try for savour into it. How much of it does help us? We can go back again, like you will say, during um, colonial times or as a consequence of colonialism, we became the first people to have electricity, to have the first airline, to have the first broadcasting service, to have the first, um, uh, they talk about all within the West African region, forget the first motor car line and etc. But that was a long time ago. We are where we are. That was then, this is now. What say you could do? How do we go forward and <clears throat> change this narrative and make this country become vibrant as we saw it over six years beyond in which most of us will dwell in and fast time when we are the first country we drive motor car, human, deluxe. Now we are the first person we get electricity, we get college and what have you. But most of the other countries are doing far better than us including Ghana and probably even Lily can be. Okay. For, for, before I answer the question, do you allow me you say one thing for the bring in me brother come Lord, they get in kind of a tear. Yes, we go look. We go look into that. I, prom I promise yes. you. I promise yes, you, sir. This is quite interesting. But, but, but more seriously, I virtually agree with everything where we not talking about today. Now, one thing no more where me before we we, we build a bridge, I want to build the foundation. And me want give me a solution. I will go forward for to build the foundation. And at the year one, as, as an example, for help me case. When I've been there today, where Mr. Boris Johnson. Lock parliament. I think doing this Brexit business in your yeah, government. Yeah. Parliament will have been there today. Yeah, yeah. But then another branch of government say, no, 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 but you don't get that power. Day. I think the Supreme Court soon say, no, no, but you don't get that power. Day. The Supreme Court not agree. I think they overturned that decision. Day. If actually, I know so go help me with that. Say, I think the case code that the Supreme Court or that one, one of the highest courts say, and that they not be thinking, Mr. Boris Johnson, in correct that man. In other words, then let, 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 let that be on a home. In we all country now, a president, he can take up himself for some of parliament any any time he wants. Mm. One person, any time he wants, he can summon the parliament. Now, what you have for talk is the foundation me where I want to be with all the good things I want to and they call up. Lord be talk about what you call the rule of law, where everybody. Subservient to the rule of law, nobody yeah. from the head man take candle. Candle, yeah. From the big man take candle. When we build Senaya within this America, great here, not only because that money or that White House or Air Force One, but because of that little law. Look what Mr. Trump they go through now. <laughs> the Attorney General in New York <laughs> yesterday, you know, they prepare a case for now. So, in other words, for them, foundation, I will the trouble, they tell the trouble. Now, this time for the election where everybody. The, the, the subservient to the laws, then, then I think say we will begin to find ourselves out of that problem. Now, so me look at more. the things are very good, but we need an anchor, and the anchor will be a do way binding on everybody. Now, this yeah. has something to let the discussion, and I want to take it back. And love, wait, love, love, baby, with what I do. I let one tell you, they bring you two. Now, see how would they, you know, born hands with anything in it because you said, you know, man, you said they eat too much in the winter. We said we'll learn from you, bro. So now the word that, sir. Many, many thanks, um, um, Mr. Kutubu. Um, Sierra Leoneans, those of you that have learned, those of you who will subsequently listen, 
There have been questions around what makes you a citizen and why should you be proud of belonging, especially to our country. In terms of Sierra Leone, this evening to end this broadcast, I want to give a free, I mean, few reasons on why you should be proud to mm -hmm. be a Sierra Leonean. Why you, would, when you are out there with other nationals, West African nationals or African nationals, what you can see, it's not that you cannot be ashamed, but that ashamedness should be able to galvanize you, motivate you, strengthen you, build up your resilience for you to become a better citizen and help others, a better citizen rather, and help others. Did you know that your country in West Africa was the first to have a broadcasting service? First to have a post office. It was the first to have an airline service in which planes landed in West Africa as 1927. It's the first and only country Country, tropical hospital, and that goes back as far back 1925. It was a school back in 1724, and I can tell that school was not a school, a grammar school. It was a school to look. Sometimes we don't present things only in a plate for you. You have to aspire yourself for information because that gives you a freedom of mind. It was also the first to have a bus back in 1827. Yeah, back in 1827. It was first to have the hospital for the mentally retarded all the way back in 1930. As a boy, part of the places that I grew up, I've told you that they born me in a dovecot. And now, like you see, two places, like you see, like even a person is in where the Christian family, they don't own this so much in London. We will go and take those places. Up there, you begin get the, cloud, the cloud has been getting massive stone nose. Who say we be while we they watch now the under sailor. So, so yeah, okay. and then we will walk, walk, go up Christian on the Black Hall Road. So we were the first to have a mental man hospital. It was the first country where motor vehicles, we talk about this already, was back in 1920. It was the first to have a legal system. This is important. They also have legal system with black judge. So Sierra Leone Supreme Court been a bit the court of appeal for Ghana, Nigeria, Zambia. So we had people from Sierra Leone who went in that particular district. And uh, they were with the prisoner. But that one was part of colonial the divide one people who was the um, to them. But these were reasons, you know, here why you could be proud then. In 1843, the entire Gold Coast, which is now known as modern day Ghana, and the Federal Republic of Nigeria, and Little Gambia, were placed under the admission of Freetown. So Freetown was the one who was taking care of these places. This historical fact, this is not satire, this is, or these are facts. In the 1800s, 17 black priests and Ghana and Nigeria as misread Christianity. And that just a fact, that's what happened because it was all part of the brain washing. 1792, Sierra Leone became the first country in the world where women first their votes. This is important. As far back as 1792, before the colonial as the most we vote freedom we were the first in 1792 women casted their no reason women cannot take the leadership position now in our country but it's a process and they are shattering class ladies and gentlemen i could go on and on these are few things for which you will be proud 
as owners. Yes, indeed. We haven't capitalized on what was left us, as Mr. Kutubu Kuroma said. We very well could have, but yet what we did, we mismanaged these things. And we're not good at management anyway. Not only us, but the broader specter of Africans. Most of what was left us was destroyed, either intentionally or by other influences, because when we wanted to take independence, as the word itself implies, independence, that is self-aspiration of a people doing what we want to do, how we want to do what we want to do, they wanted to restrict us. And once we decided that we are not going to be, the process of undermining started. Hence, most countries are not successful today. We could go on and on and on, but Fambule, every good thing has come to an end. I want to say thank you to Mr. Mohamed Kutubu Kuruma and Mr. Imran Khan, but just like you see, then program they are so they're necessary for bringing the information. If civic education for once more come back, we all can take the lead and lend with voices. Don't forget, tomorrow, Mohammed Kamara will the spearhead the Inside Salon program today on the Then and Now Empire. We'll be right on this platform and talk with one of APC Alejo, what they call Mr. Mikailo back, Mr. Mikailo Koroma, go day on the platform. On Sunday, Mr. Seth will be on the platform with this new program what we call the weekly review we go look at news per clippings, news that will make the headlines for the week. Like when the president will speak now CNN, the state opening of parliament will bring brilliant minds for can analyze. For them, for the then and our platform, me now on a host and presenter, Prince Emil Koma, they say, on a goodbye, good night, good morning, and bye bye. Mr. Koma, thank you very much, sir. Good night. Thank you. Good night. Yeah, thank you, my brother. Yeah,